important service information about my Jeep Gladiator and apparently my oil changes are overdue. What did Jeep send me now? Good morning, everybody. How are you today? Pretty good here. And apparently I have some sort of important service information. I hope it's not a recall. And uh, some oil change information from Jeep about my Jeep Gladiator. So let's uh, set you guys down here. I will share this with you guys uh, and we'll see what it actually is all about. Okay, let's go ahead and start with the overdue service notification i guess and you know i find these things funny because they start sending you these and they even start calling you telling you that you got to get in there and you got to get your oil changed well what if you don't drive a lot of miles you know why would you take your truck in to have the oil changed when it isn't due for i don't know three thousand more miles something like that who knows it's crazy but let's go ahead and see what it says it expires soon so they're trying to put the fear into you already um, let's see here. Go ahead, get this open. It says, your 2020 Jeep Gladiator's past due for important maintenance. Schedule service today and trust our expert technicians to take care of the following service. Change the engine oil. Okay, well, if I still had that, I'm sure this is for my other Jeep Gladiator before I went to uh, the white one I have now. But what are they gonna do for me, right? And this is supposed to be covered. It says, follow these expert tips or follow these tips from your vehicle experts. Uh, number one, don't forget your Jeep Wave benefits like oil changes, tire rotations, first day rental coverage and 24 seven owner support. That's awesome. Number two, earn 5% cash back on all Jeep brand uh, vehicle maintenance. Well, that's if you happen to have their credit card, which I don't. And number three, it says, make care convenient. Our experts are here to make maintenance as quick and as convenient as possible. Kind of funny. Uh, with smart diagnostics, authentic Mopar parts, and factory trained techs, we'll get you, you back on the road ASAP. Well, that's awesome. And they go ahead and they send me a couple of little cards here, it looks like. It says, remember to use your complimentary Jeep Wave services and tire rotation 10% off. So now I'm confused. It looked like it was included up here, but now they're giving me 10% off. I don't know. Is that 10% off of nothing? I, I don't know. Uh, what's on the other side? Uh, nothing. Just their, uh, their little verbiage thing there. Not a big deal. Okay, now the big one. This one. Right here on the front, you'll notice it says, Important Service Information About Your Vehicle. Well, that's always foreboding right off, right? I mean, do I have a problem? I don't know. Let me go ahead and rip this open and we'll take a look at it. Okay, let's see what we've got. Um, conveniently came all blacked out. How'd that happen? I, it must be movie magic. Okay, it says, Dear, whoever you are, congratulations on the purchase of your new 2020 Gladiator Sport 4x4. Really? I've had this truck for a year. Our records indicate that you did not take advantage of a Mopar vehicle protection plan, the MVP plan, when you purchased your vehicle. Well, that's true. I did not because I never do. Um, a Mopar vehicle protection plan protects your 2020 Gladiator Sport 4x4 from unexpected costly vehicle repairs on more than 5,000 components for up to either uh, or for up to the earlier of eight years or 125,000 miles. Now, one thing that I'll mention before we move on in this, do I not have a three-year warranty as it is? Why would I want this now? I don't know. Okay, so why? Well, maybe they'll explain it here. Why buy MVP from Mopar Direct? Well, buy from the best for less, up to 40% savings and no sales tax. 
which it says right up here, save up to 40% today from the number one internet provider, internet provider uh, of genuine Mopar vehicle protection plans in the US and then a phone number. I don't understand this internet provider. I'm not looking for internet service. I, I don't know. Uh, next, it says, honored at all Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, Ram, Fiat, or Alfa Romeo. Man, they're going to need like a page to list all these different companies. Dealerships throughout North America. Well, that's, that's good, I guess. 100% backed by the people that built your vehicle. Fiat Chrysler, LLC. 0% uh, financing and no credit check. Gain all the benefits of MVP while paying over time. I see. So these plans are so expensive that apparently you have to pay for them in installments. That's not good. Money back guarantee. Hope so. Hassle free over 1 billion claims paid. Now, one must ask themselves, is it good that this company has paid over 1 billion claims? I don't want to necessarily have a vehicle that's had 1 billion claims against it. I'm just saying, that's not a good advertising point, in my opinion. Uh, next, Trusted Care Certified Factory Trained. Uh, technicians and only genuine Mopar parts and service. Well, I would hope they're factory trained because otherwise that'd be a drag. Avoid expensive repair costs with a zero deductible option. You could pay nothing on future covered repairs for the life of your plan. Now, check this out. They give you a listing of what things might cost you. Again, never good to tell you that your vehicles, you know, are going to have these problems. Uh, the engine could be $7,825. Transmission, $5,150. Steering gear, what? 3,093, and then the differential, I guess, on this Ram truck, 2,666. You pay nothing with zero deductible. Other deductible options available. So it depends on what you're willing to pay, right? Repair costs, only to be used as an example. Actual costs may vary by vehicle repair and dealer location. So they're taking a guess. Um, and they give a number you can go ahead and call. Let's flip this sucker over. All right, if it's mechanical, it's covered. MVP has many term options to fit your driving needs. Our best plan, Maximum Care, covers more than 5,000 mechanical components. Below is an overview of some of the parts and systems covered. So briefly, engine transmission driveline, air conditioning, engine and cooling and fuel systems, electrical expanded, uh, electrical, brakes, analog brakes, instrumentation, power group, body mecha mechanisms, manual interior mechanisms, safety and security steering, front and rear suspension, and high tech. Pretty much the whole truck, it sounds like. Didn't mention paint anywhere, did it? I don't think I see anything about paint. Uh, added features and benefits. Sign and go roadside assistance. Towing allowance, car rental allowance. Key fob repair replacement. They always try to get you on that one. Trip interruption coverage. And it's transferable. Or, and they don't tell you this, maybe in the small print somewhere, but if you bought one of these, you should be able to get your money back on a prorated basis. I'm just saying. Okay, why buy from Mopar Direct? Well, Mopar discount up to $575, no sales tax up to $200. Total savings $775. I think they just pulled that number out of the air. I don't know what they're basing that on. It says here, well, here we go. Savings uh, shown based on discount and tax savings for maximum care coverage uh, of eight years, 125,000 miles. Uh, let's see, right now you're enjoying the security that comes with your three-year, 36,000-mile base warranty coverage, whichever comes first. Extend that security today with the MVP protection plan, allowing you to avoid surprise and potential expensive vehicle repairs down the road. Sincerely, Director of Sales, and they give a phone number. Now, what you always have to be curious about when you get something like this, Nowhere on here, unless I missed it, and you guys saw the whole thing yourselves, I mean, I went through the whole thing. Nowhere on here does it tell me what any of these plans cost. If it's such a great deal, why isn't it transparent? Why aren't the figures listed here? Because it's a sales job. They want you to call them. So one of their highly trained internet providers, I guess, their service people, the people that answer the phone, can convince you to buy one of these plans. Specifically, the maximum, what do they call it? The maximum care plan. And I'm guessing that's probably anywhere between $1,500 and $2,500. Could be a little bit more, I'm not exactly sure. Um, who knows, maybe I'll make a call one of these days to these folks and, uh, and put you guys on with me so you can actually hear what the sales uh, uh, 
effort is or what they're what they try to do i guess it, it might be kind of interesting to see uh now my philosophy on these plans i gotta say i may be a bit jaded because i never buy them i never have uh and i don't because i've never actually needed one and i've had i don't know 65 new cars over my lifetime and i know that's absurd but i have and i've never needed one of these in my life they are just a money-making proposition for the company. That's what they're for. They make tons of money on these things because frankly, most vehicles never use them, right? Or people get out of them, sell them, and never realize they could have gotten their money back. So they just, they keep it. They make tons of money. Plus, while they're holding the money you pay on these, you know, while you're not using it, they're earning interest on a bank account. One other thing I will mention, of course, there are instances where these, uh, come into play. You know, every vehicle is going to have a problem at some point, and you might be one of the lucky or unlucky, depending on how you look at it, one of the people who bought one of these who actually needed it. Because when I post these kind of videos, I always get somebody that comes on and says, well, one mile after my warranty expired, my transmission died, and this thing saved me X amount of dollars. Well, that's good. That's good. But in general, that doesn't happen. Anyway, leave a comment, let me know. I'd be curious if you have bought one of these, have you ever had to use it? I mean, really, be honest. Let me know, I'm curious. Also, real quick, if you're interested, I have two additional channels. Rob Motive, all about my 2020 Toyota Tacoma. And Rob Motive Civic, about my experiences with the Honda Civic Type R and the Honda Civic Sport Hatchback. Check them out, and if you're interested, why the heck wouldn't you subscribe? Don't forget to click that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. And do me a favor, smash that subscribe button on the way out. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Bye.